Hello everyone, today I'm going to be talking about some news about the stock market but before we get it started just give me a favor and subscribe to the channel and give it a thumbs up as I really would appreciate it and without further ado let's get started. The stock's market rally continued to run to a new highs last week with Apple stock and other tech giants leading the way and several IPOs making big moves but the Nasdaq is extended heading into the heart of earning season. If results of guidelines disappoint especially among leaders such as Tesla stock, the reaction could be negative. Tesla, AMD, Apple, Facebook, Microsoft and Capillar stock are all technically interesting. Apple stock is in an official buy zone while several other are actionable or nearby points. These are huge companies that can have a major impact on the on the indices. Apple has a 2.36 trillion market cap. Microsoft stock is 1.71 trillion. Tesla at 802 billion while Facebook stock is 782 billion. Even AMD stock and CAD are worth more than 100 billion. These giants also could spur moves in rivals, customers and suppliers. Apple results will echo through the iPhone ecosystem including key chip makers such as Qualcomm, Tesla earnings and Gartness and stock action could spur big moves in EV stocks such as Neo. AMD will be key for NVIDIA and other data center chip makers. Microsoft will inform investors about PC demand, cloud computing, think Amazon and Google and enterprise software, Facebook earnings and uh, commentary about political headwinds will be important for Twitter, Google, Parent Alphabet and uh, as well as other social sites and uh, online app ads. Capillar is a global economic bellwether and among several cyclical stocks nearby points in the mining and materialized space. Right now, we will go to Microsoft earnings. Uh, Wall Street sees Microsoft earnings per share of uh, 1.64 on sales of uh, 40.18 billion, both up um, 9%. Cloud revenue, including Azure cloud computing services, and expected to drive growth. Microsoft stock jumped 6.20%, 25% to 225.95, clearing a downward sloping trend line. But fading below to other early entries on Friday. The official buy points is 232.69. AMD earnings. Analysts forecast AMD earnings per share up 47% to 47 cents with revenue rising 42% to 3.02 billion. AMD stock rose 5.2% to 9 uh, to 92.79 last week, reclaiming a poor year at 88.82 buy points and its 10-week line. But it is also in a messy consolidation about above the old base. Apple earnings. Apple earnings. Analyst expects fiscal Q1 Apple earnings per share of 1.40 on sales of 102.76 billion, both up 12% with strong holiday sales of new 5G iPhone as well as update Mac computers and wearables. Apple's Apple stock shoot up 9.4% last week to 139.07. Tesla earnings. Wall Street's pitches Tesla earnings surging 107% to 85 cents a share, with revenue up 35% to 10 billion. Guidance on 2021 Tesla deliveries as well as update on the cyber track and two factories under constructions will be key. Tesla stock is extended after looking like a climax run. Shares have traded relatively tightly over the past two weeks. Neo stock, Lyoto and Xpeng Motors will report January sales in the first week of February. Facebook earnings. Analysts forecasts Facebook earnings per share rising 23% to 3.15 with revenue up 25% to 26.3 billion. Facebook stock rebounded from its 200 line surging 9.2% to 
274 Boeing 50 back above its 50 day line. Arguably, Facebook stock is an, is an early entry from downwards sloping trend line, but investors may want to see a strong move to a signal a shift after months of lagging. That's it for today. I hope you enjoyed the video. Until the next time, see you next.